Hi Leo, welcome to your unexpected reading for January 11th, is it? <coughs> Excuse me, January 11th through the 25th. Everything you need to know about this fellow reading is in the description box below. King of Swords. Hmm. Could be Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra. Hmm. Okay. Might be what's coming in. Judgment. Nine of Coins. Let's move you up here. There we go. Nine of Coins. Page of Wands. Seven of Wands. The Wheel. The High Priestess. All right, so what's going on here? Okay. I'm going to clarify with these. All right, so the issue is somebody taking a good, long, hard look at themselves and being discerning and being honest with themselves. Perhaps there's past issues that need to be dealt with in the present. Somebody needs to make a decision. All right, so making a decision. Oops. Could be that somebody's feeling kind of stubborn about that. What's this judgment card about? Someone's not willing to take change their thinking. Um, okay, so this is somebody that might be taking some time to think about it, uh, considering weighing the options, seeing about what's what for the future. Is it going to be worth it? That sort of thing. All right. So it's going to be an issue of independence and being able to be stable on your own. Um, it's, it's your time to learn that or to get accustomed to that or somebody else's uh, idea or basically that it's about independence and being on your own, being secure on your own. I don't think that's a stretch for you, Leo, so I'm not sure this is talking about you, but maybe your partner. What's this Knight of Coins about? Again, with the judgment, uh, making a decision. So making a decision if you want to be by yourself or not. Making a decision if you want to be single or not. You're deciding whether to leave this relationship or stay in this relationship. Maybe it's with an Aquarius. Um, or you're having some, you're, you're really delving into uh, thinking about things and trying to decide and make a clear authoritative choice. And it looks like there's a fire sign involved. It's pretty clear cut. Here. Well, at least as far as all the players involved here. It looks like another fire sign. What's this page of wands about? Could be Scorpio, but the, okay, or it could be a water sign Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. So this is uh, realizing that probably somebody was stepping out or there's someone was interested elsewhere. Uh, you just realized that, and uh, it might you might be dealing with a water sign. So there might have been some flirting, sexting, texting, that sort of thing. Um, can't believe sexting is a word. <laughs> uh, <laughs> what would that have been 20 years ago, you know? Uh, just dated myself. Anyway, uh, this could be that this has just come to light, that you've just realized the beginnings of an affair with somebody else. And it doesn't look like there's a whole lot unexpected here. Hang on a second. This is pretty much following suit with what somebody would do if they discovered an affair. So you're conflicted. Why? There's fighting. Why? You have the advantage here. It's just seven of wands for Leo. Well, you need to go inward and use your uh, intuition. You need to, you, why? What, why do you need, why? I'm mm, shutting up. What's that seven of wands about? Okay. Leo, I think we're talking about a pregnancy. 
I think the unexpected element here is that you're going to be pregnant. Somebody's pregnant. Uh, she or he is pregnant in this scenario. There is a pregnancy or because we got we got kids and we got a new beginning birth basically. So I think there's going to I think the shocker, the unexpected element here is that somebody is uh, there is a pregnancy involved in in uh, this either decision making whether it's the this has led to a pregnancy this stepping out of the relationship has led to a pregnancy or um you're getting ready to leave leo and then all of a sudden hi i'm pregnant you or your partner um and we you don't know what's going to happen so there's going to be the this is this probably is internal conflict here because the a pregnancy is now on the table do you want to you know, support the pregnancy from afar? Do you want to stay in the relationship? Like how, or, or do you want to uh, leave while pregnant? I mean, it's, it's, you know, it's this wheel here for, it's this wheel for Leo. It's this wheel. Wow. Okay. Or not, because it looks like you're going <laughs> to, Okay, so that you're making a decision whether you want to leave this relationship or not. The unexpected element, holy crap, <laughs> that comes into play is a pregnancy. Um, and shocking yourself probably because you're conflicted about it. But it looks like what's going to happen um, with probably verbal sparring and hashing this out and also the internal conflict going on is that you, um, it's going to be a very quick decision to... It's funny, it's like round and round the wheel goes. So there's probably going to be arguments and things done in haste. And then there's going to be a lot of back and forth. And it looks like there is going to be, okay, let's take the relationship to the next level. Let's really commit. Let's, let's. Or, because what bothers me about that though is that this is, there's fighting going this way, facing the conflict. And that there's leaving and approaching someone else with an offer here. So either there's a lot of fast and hard decisions and words and whatever and we decide to commit and take it to the next level and and uh, strengthen the relationship in light of this pregnancy or this is very quickly and expediently i'm out i'm done i'm out of here and i'm gonna go find um interest with somebody else or i'm gonna i'm gonna find somebody else here it really does depend on you going inward and thinking about what the best thing to do for you is What's this Knight of Cups about? Just I want to see here because you really are thinking about this long and hard. Knight of Cups, what is that? This could be Pisces or Scorpio, by the way. Knight of Cups. Why? Could be a Capricorn that you're thinking of staying with, or again with the either or this is general. Um you're returning to the situation which there's a lot to clean up there's a lot of baggage here there's a lot of um hmm. it could be that you're asking to go be with someone right now just for sex it could be that this in fact is you deciding whether you want to stay and you're almost out the door but then this is about re the realization that there's uh, been cheating involved right and or there's new interest there's either some kind of epiphany with cheating or new interest and it could be with a water sign and then we've got the pregnancy issue and then we've got all right i'm out since since there's pregnancy that means you've been cheating i'm out uh perhaps and then you know so that gets handled over here and then we go rushing off into the future with somebody else but it's probably based on anything but love um, if you stay with the situation, there's going to be a lot of, if you, if you make that offer in the situation you're in, or if the, they make the offer to you, it's going to be a lot to clean up. There's a lot of baggage, a lot of, uh, toxicity, but if it's somebody new, it looks like it's just going to be primarily for sex. So just keep that in mind. And it really does depend on your intuition, uh, your intuition, you going inward and making what you think is best for you. It doesn't seem like you're talking to a whole lot of people about the, these this is very solitary this is very solitary this is very solitary so this is you deciding on your own terms in your own brain with your own intuition basically uh we're talking about leo you are leo's i'm reading for you're very independent you make your own decisions you do your own thing leo 
expect a miracle. Again, with the, the child reference there. Do you see the baby? Have faith that your prayers have been answered, heard, and are being answered. I think this is doubling down on the pregnancy because we got the, the kid there. We got this sort of, this literally out of the blue, like, whoa, what? Wait, what? <laughs> Pregnant. Okay. Leo. Hello. Leo. What does Leo need to know, Leo? Connections with others, um, how our relationships define us. So, the, you know, this could be the sacred spiritual bond. Um, this could be saying honor your connection or your psychic link with this person over here or to whoever you feel that psychic link with. If it is this person or maybe it's going off with this other person, um, this is... Wow. Not this, sorry. This is, um, it, I think it's going back to this card of independence here. And because this is, this person has everything they, they need to sustain and to move forward and to be happy by themselves. There's somebody that's occupying their thoughts that they can't be with though. They don't need that person. They just want them. So that's probably what you're thinking about. Whereas in this situation right here, this is somebody that you feel like you need. Could be Capricorn, but it just, it, it feels like there's a decision between two people here. And the one that has your attention is the one that you can't have. Um, and of course, and then we have the pregnancy aspect too. Just, there's a lot going on here. No wonder why you're like, I need to be by myself to think about this. I need to figure out, you know, pick between these two people. Cause there's the one person I can't be with and somebody's pregnant, and then there's this over, I mean, okay. Leo. 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 I might have to read from the book for this one. I'm not that proficient with the deck yet, but it's, it's got some beautiful imagery here. Leo. And, and the messages are pretty solid. Leo. What does Leo need to know? Breathe. <laughs> Breathe. Well, there's a lot on your mind, right? Breathe. Uh, short answer is breathe. But um, this is don't be in too much hurry right now. Too much of a hurry right now. The heart needs to open, take a breath, and let nature take its course. Release constriction and anxiety for there is no need for tension. Savor the moment and the waiting won't be difficult. Your heart knows what the ego often le resists learning. Patience pays off in deep and meaningful ways. So, okay, that this is saying you got a, obviously a decision to make. And this is saying wait, um, go inward. <laughs> Use that intuition, connect to source, respect the connection that you have with this person or with your... Um, you know, this is this is somebody that can make pretty solid decisions too. Honestly, like this, you've got a you've probably got a pretty strong mind or strong will. You're pretty confident, so it's not going to be a stretch. But you are going to be thinking long and hard over what to do here, who to choose here. Just saying, this I think this out of the blue here, <laughs> that's that's uh, that's a game changer for sure. So, okay, Leo, that is what I have for you. I wish you luck with this, truly, um, and I hope to see you in the next reading. Take care.